Greetings all, my name is Ixan Faro Kurniawan uh, of class IR and Zone TP. I am an LSPR Communication and Business Institute student under the supervision of Mr. Charles Bonar Sirait as my mentor and lecturer. I am here to talk to you about climate change, an issue which is very important for the sustainable world. What is climate change? Climate change is a long-term change in the average weather patterns that have come to define the Earth's local, regional, and global climates. These changes have a broad range of observed effects that are synonymous with the term. Changes observed in the Earth's climate since the early 20th century are primarily driven by human activities, particularly fossil fuel burning, which increases heat uh, trapping greenhouse gas level in the Earth's atmosphere, raising Earth's average surface temperature. These human-produced uh, temperature increases are commonly re referred to as global warming. Natural processes can also contribute to, the, to climate change, including internal variability and external forces. Scientists mm -hmm. use observation from the ground, air, and space, along with theoretical models, to monitor and study the past, mm -hmm. present, and future climate change. Climate data records uh, provide uh, evidence of climate change key indicators, set, such as global land, global land and ocean temperature increases, rising sea levels, ice loss at the Earth's pole and in mountain glaciers, frequency and severity, severity changes in extreme weather such as hurricanes, heat waves, wildfires, droughts, floods, and cloud and vegetation uh, cover changes. To name but a few. Now, how do you know that the Earth's climate is changing? We know what the Earth's past climate was like by studying things that have been around for a long time. For example, scientists can study what the Earth's uh, climate was like hundreds of years ago by studying the inside of trees that have been alive since then. But if scientists really want to know what the Earth's climate was like hundreds of thousands to millions of years ago, they study sediment uh, cores and ice cores. Sediment cores come from the bottom of ocean lakes, lakes and the ocean floor. Ice cores are drilled from deep, sometimes miles below the surface of the ice in places like Antarctica. The layers in, uh, in an ice core are frozen solid. These layers of ice give clues about every year of the Earth's history back to the time of the deepest layer was formed. The ice contains bubbles of the air each year. Scientists analyze the, analyze, uh, the, babel, the bubbles in each layer to see how much CO2 they contain. Scientists can also use the ice core to learn about uh, the temperature for each year. As snow accumulates onto, in, onto a growing glacier, the temperature of the air imprints onto the water uh, molecules in the ice. Now what is causing the Earth's climate to change? Climate change can be caused by a variety of factors, but we can argue that the, the, the human activities are the main reasons as to why climate, uh, the, the Earth's climate is changing. The main driver of climate change is the greenhouse effect. Some gases in the Earth's atmosphere act a bit like the gas glass in the greenhouse, trapping the sun's heat and stopping it from leaking back into space and causing global warming. Many of these greenhouse gases occur naturally, but human activity is increasing the concentration of some of them in, in, in the atmosphere. In particular, there are carbon dioxide, methane, nitrous oxide, and fluorinated gases. CO2 produced by human activities is the largest contributor to global warming. By 2020, its concentration in the atmosphere has risen to 48% above its pre-industrial pre level, that is, uh, before 1750. Other greenhouse gas uh, are emitted by human activity in small quantities. Methane is a more powerful greenhouse gas than CO2 but it has a shorter atmospheric lifetime. Nitrous oxide, like CO2, is a long-lived greenhouse uh, gas that accumulates in the Earth's atmosphere uh, uh, over decades to centuries. Now, what might happen to the Earth's climate? Climate change destabilized uh, the Earth's temperature equilibrium and has far-reaching effects on human beings and the environment. During the course of global warming, uh, the energy balance and thus the temperature of the Earth's change due to the increased global concentration of greenhouse gases which has a significant impact on humans and environment. Uh, as the global climate change is highly interconnected system that is influenced by many different factors, the consequences usually result in a feedback in a positive or negative feedback effects. This refers to development that are self-enhancing due to occurrence uh, of certain conditions. A common example is the ice albedo effect which refers to the melting of the polar caps. According to this, 
Extensive ice surfaces have a cooling effect on the global climate as a high proportion of radiation is reflected. Um, a result of the climate of, of the global rise in the average temperature, however, uh, these uh, these ice ice surfaces have begun to melt. Uh, the ice surfaces shrink and the amount of reflected radiation is reduced. At the same time, the area of land or ocean that has a significant lower albedo will increase, resulting less radiation and thus intensifying the actual cost of glacier melt. Furthermore, scientists can calculate the so-called tipping points of individual subsystems of the global climate. The higher the global rise in temperature, the more the climate system is affected, so that the, at the certain point, uh, despite significant errors, uh, a reversal in the in the in the process uh, no longer possible, where exactly these tipping points can be found. However, uh, it's uh, currently still unclear and can only be calculated with a great degree of uncertainty. Such tipping points are expected to do for the melting of the polar caps and for the stability of ocean currents. Now, what can we do to help? There is no one-size-fits-all approach to stopping or slowing down global warming, and each individual, business, municipal, state, tribal, and federal entity must weigh their options in light of their own unique set of circumstances. Experts say it is likely many strategies working together will be needed. Generally speaking, here are some examples of mitigation strategies we can use to slow or stop the human-caused global warming. Where possible, we can switch off switch to renewable sources of energy such as solar and energy and wind energy to power our homes and buildings, thus emitting far less heat trapping gases into the atmosphere. Where feasible, we can drive electric vehicles instead of those uh, that burn fossil fuels. We can use mass transit instead of driving our own cars. Where affordable, we can conserve energy by better insult insul insulating our homes and buildings and by replacing old failing appliances with more energy efficient models. Where practicable, we can counter counterbalance our annual carbon dioxide emission by investing in com commercial services that draw down an equal amount of carbon out of the atmosphere, such as through planting trees or carbon on or carbon capture and storage techniques techniques where practical uh, we can support more local bases that, that use promote sustainable climate smart practices such as those listed above we can consider placing an upper limit uh, on the amount of carbon dioxide that we will allow ourselves to emit into the atmosphere within a, a given uh, time frame uh, stabilizing global uh, temperature near its current level requires eliminating all emissions of heat trappings. Gases are uh, equivalently achieving a carbon neutral society in which people remove as much as carbon from the atmosphere as they emit. Achieving this goal will require substantial societal changes in energy technologies and infrastructure that go beyond collective uh, action of individuals and households to reduce emission. Now, that is all for me. Um, that is all that, that concludes our talk about climate change I would like to thank you very much uh, for uh, hearing uh, for seeing uh, this uh, video thank you